least a dozen car break-ins in less than two weeks has one Milwaukee community on edge. The Cooper Park neighborhood is on the city's far northwest side near the border with Wauwatosa. Our Tony Atkins talked to residents about the uptick in crime. A rash of car break-ins leads to a lot of concern for people living in Milwaukee's Cooper Park neighborhood. Today I spoke with a number of them about these break-ins and to find out what's being done. Not sure what's going on, but there's definitely been a lot of car break-ins. Uh, we've never had any issues over here, mm -hmm. so yeah, this is alarming to hear. People in the Cooper Park area of Milwaukee are understandably concerned about a spike in car break-ins since August 1st. A ring doorbell caught this August 6th car break-in on camera. One man can be seen with an electric screwdriver, another with what appears to be a handgun. Now they're carrying... Uh, firearms and weapons. So it's just like, what do we do as citizens? What do we do as residents? Just continue to sit around and do nothing. Joe Valdez reached out to TMJ4 News. Frustrated, the break-ins keep happening here. Other victims of break-ins have taken to social media, posting about what's happened to them. Police say they are aware of the break-ins and are asking people to call them with information. But the owner of this car that was broken into says he wants to make sure black people aren't profiled as investigators look to find the people responsible for the crimes. Other residents say they're going to remain alert and maintain strong communication in person and online to help keep the area safe. We definitely need to get it figured out. Like because this issue definitely needs to be resolved sooner than later. And those residents say if you know anything about these break-ins or who may be responsible to give Milwaukee police a call. Reporting in the Cooper Park neighborhood, Tony Atkins, TMJ4 News.